was in the body competition. Uh, so I think there were 10, 10 firms to begin with, uh, which was then shortlisted to three. Mm -hmm. So we went, uh, and we presented presented here. So it really happened in June last year uh, when it started, and then we went through a range of iterations. Really, we really finished design in November, and then started. So that's a pretty short lead time, really, for Definitely. such a substantial. Um, project definitely, definitely. We, uh, we had the prototype finished in December, and then we started production in January. Can you tell me a little bit about the technology? The whole thing is uh, prefabricated, so it's all built off site in the factory. There's 152, and everything is unique. So there's tens of there's thousands of components. Each one is unique. The only elements of the project that are common are the bolts and screws that hold it together. Um, so really, it was it's a logistical pro project of tracking and and, um, and and you know managing all of that information and material. The shell um, holds the whole thing together, so it's all self-supporting. So most of us know Corian as kitchen bench tops. Exactly. Does it have other uses? Or? Exactly. Yeah. No, it's used for kitchen bench tops and hospital. In this case, what we're doing is using it as a structural. So it's actually providing the structural. Uh, support as well, so it's holding itself up, and and then we have uh, these brackets of 452 or so stainless brackets which come which come off the crane and then hold the the internal lining up, which is which is uh, mirror polished black stainless steel, each of which is curved uh, to make these pillows. It's pretty sexy, isn't it? So how do you see this as a model for future architecture projects? Well, I think one thing that's different is um, it changes the way architecture is produced, not just this project, but it's, it's, it's one in a series of projects which is starting to shift the way that architecture is made. And rather than bring a whole bunch of uh, sticks and, and sheets to site which you then chop up and make into a building, um, everything is, is designed um, to efficiently use material and resources off-site uh, to be produced to a higher quality, uh, a higher level of standard than brought to site and, and put together. So the on-site build is quite, is very quick. Right. So the whole thing went together in about um, you know, probably eight to ten years. Yeah, really fantastic. We've learned a, a great deal. Um, and I think one thing, you know, we really took on a lot of responsibility by not just being taking on the design, but then also the all of the fabrication and the assembly as well, and um, which was a huge learning experience. Gina Fairley, reporting for Arts Hub.